With this video, we will be doing MGK Rap Devil. And if you want to help this channel and the content that we're making, please help support our merchandise. The link is in the description. And if you didn't hit that like button, make sure you hit the like button. Trying to get the channel to grow. And the only way we're going to do this, if you like, share, and comment on the content. So without further ado, let's get into this song. Let's go! Chi Chi, get the Yayo. Get the Yayo. World Star Hip Hop. I mean, that joint is big. Yeah, everybody. Now I don't get on that for nothing. Yeah, oh my God, Ronnie. Hey, oh my God. Somebody grabbing some clippers. This fucking beard is weird. Mm. Talk, talk from a rapper paying millions for security a year. Mm. I think my dad's gone crazy. Yeah, Haley, you right. Dad's always mad, cooped up in the studio, yelling at the mic. Uh. So that's where that, uh, that's where it, well, it was obviously directed, but when he said he mentioned Haley. Yeah. That's where everybody been saying. Yeah. From the other video From the other dish that we did. Yeah. I remember we talking about the cereal bowl, too, in there. He's like, what's that in the bowl? Yeah, what's in the bowl? Like, um, I don't know why, but when this video came out, I thought it looked cool him just walking around rapping, eating a bowl of cereal. I don't know why, but I always thought it, it looked cool, but, um... I always liked it, this this. I thought this was a cool disc. Crazy thing out. is, I'm seeing this for the first time. Yeah, that's a good thing about it. We ain't gonna keep you uh we ain't gonna keep you held up. Um but he did land some shots uh, when he said um, Yeah, he came out. How you fine. talking tough when you pay millions for security? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Which is a valid point. Um he was saying something about his beard. And I know everybody didn't like the Eminem with the the Eminem with the beard look. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Oh my god, Ronnie. Hey, somebody grab me some clippers. This fucking beard is weird. Tough talk from a rapper paying millions for security a year. I think my dad's gone crazy. Yeah, Haley, you right. Dad's always mad, cooped up in the studio, yelling at the mic. Yeah. You're sober and bored, huh? I know. I'm about to be 46 years old, dog. Talking about, I'm a cold up trick trick. Man, you sound like a bitch, bitch. Man, I'm a handle you. Sh mm. That landed. Wow, that was one of Pocky out his. Yeah. Um, but he said, uh,. Come on, you're gonna call it Trick Trick. Um, because 46. One, one of his songs, he was saying, Maybe call up Trick Trick. We don't play the disrespect in Detroit. Yeah. Da 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 da. So that bar landed to my, you're gonna call up Trick Trick. You sound like a. Yeah. That was tough. That's crazy. And you know what? I gotta give him that one because, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> he parried and came back. Yeah, 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 yeah. The beat tough. Um, yeah, it's tough. Was well, this, well, this a sample beat? This was. I think I heard this beat. I don't know if I heard this song I don't know so many where times I heard it that from. I think, maybe it just subconsciously. I don't know. Yeah. Always no, mad, cooped up in the studio, yelling at the mic. You sober and bored, huh? I know. I'm about to be 46 years old, dog. Talk about I'm a cold up trick trick. Man, you sound like a bitch, bitch. Man, if I handle your shit. Mad right. about something I said in 2012. Took you six years and a surprise album just to come with a diss. Mm -hmm. Homie, you get it. We know that you're the greatest rapper alive. Fucking dweeb, all you do is read the dictionary and stay inside. Fuck mm -hmm. rap god, I'm the rap devil. Come a bare face with a black. Mm. I'm the rap devil, and he was coming. So after rap, after. Though, I'm the rap devil. Okay, he, you know what I'm saying? I it's it's wild that I, I heard the other the M's this, mm. and they said it came after this one. Yeah, it did. So like I'm hearing in reverse order. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Well, I'm seeing the visual in reverse order. Right. You know what I'm saying? And now that I'm seeing and hearing, I'm like, well, I can see why they said you know. He kind of threw a couple punches. It's yeah, a couple yeah, that's yeah. landed early in this jump. Yeah, and I can now see why there was a response. Yeah. Because I, mean, I always wondered, that, like, why did he say something back? He had the response. Had to this. respond to this one. This right here, when this dropped, it was the same. Not the same, but a little bit under when Nas dropped Ether. Did this it. made a... It made an impact. Did it. Man, if I handle your shit, uh, mad about something I said in 2012, took you six years and a surprise album just to come with a diss. Uh, homie, we get it. We know that you're the greatest rapper alive. Fucking dweeb, all you do is read the dictionary and stay inside. Fuck rap god, I'm the rap devil. Come a bare face with a black shovel like the Armageddon. When the smoke settle, his body next to this instrumental. I'm uh, I'm sick of them sweatsuits and them corny hats. Let's talk about it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's talk about it. Uh, 
He said, man, I'm tired of them sweatsuits and them corny hats. Um, Cause we were just talking about that the other day. You already know what Eminem's gonna have on when you see him. He's gonna have on some sweatpants uh, and on a uh, sweatshirt. You that's what, what you call the. That's what you call the keep the bag outfit. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's comfortable was, in the that's mug. Like, that's like the staple. Stay, yeah. Like you already know what you're gonna see. For yeah. the most part, you see Eminem. You like get a fresh, fresh, fresh outfit. You the same thing every day, and I ain't even t- not even touch the bag. And it's like dope when you think about it now, because he had the money to have all the designer. Everything like you said. Him. I'm not wasting all my money um, on that. Even though I got the money to do it, it's just wasteful. wasteful. You know what I'm saying? The same approach uh, 50 Cent take. 50 Cent don't spend. He could buy it all, but he don't. He be just grabbing regular stuff. Like, I'm going to save the money. You do is read the dictionary and stay inside. Fuck rap God, I'm the rap devil. Come a bare face with a black shovel like the Armageddon. When the smoke settle, his body next to this instrumental. I'm saying, I'm sick of them sweatsuits and them corny hats. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. Bubba was singing dance with the Midwest. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. Oh, we can get gully. I'll size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Mm. Let's talk about the fact you actually black bought a rapper that's twice as young as you. Let's call Sway, ask why I can't go up to Shape 45 because of you. Mm. Let's ask Skinnerscope how you had Paul Rosenberg trying to shelf me. Huh? Still can't. He said, ask Sway why I can't go up there to Shade 45 because of you. He's like, yo, you a way bigger rapper than me. No, and but you... Shade 45 is his, you know what I mean? So. Yeah, but I not, can see why you can't come up there. But yeah, he was talking about um, how you way bigger than me, and you yeah. just even paying him. You trying to put my little campfire out? You feel yeah, what I'm saying? Water gun. But it's easy when it's like a big artist. Like you heard that a lot about Nicki Minaj, just taking people's careers and stumping them out. You feel what I'm yeah. saying? So he was saying like, "Yo, you was trying to like a fire blanket. You were trying to take food out of my daughter's <laughs> mouth." And it's funny because Eminem. And one of his songs said, I would never was the type of rapper to take food out of someone's mouth. And if you're doing what he said you're doing, I don't know. Yeah, I wasn't there. <laughs> but if if you was doing that, yeah, you, stop me from doing X, Y, Z. You're literally taking food out of my daughter's mouth. Inside, fuck rap god, I'm the rap devil. Come a bare face with a black shovel like the Armageddon. When the smoke settle, his body next to this instrumental. I'm saying, I'm sick of them sweatsuits and corny ass. Let's, let's talk, talk about, about it. it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. Bubba was singing dance from the Midwest, we let's talk about it. Or we can get gully, y'all size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Hey, let's talk about the fact you actually black ball a rapper that's twice as young as you. Mm. Let's call Sway, ask why I can't go up to Shape 45 because of you. Mm. Let's ask Skinnerscope how you had Paul Rosenberg trying to shelf me. Mm. Still can't cover up the fact your last four albums is bad as your selfie. Now tell me, what are you staying for? What? I know you can't stand yourself, bro. Trying to be the old you so bad, you stay in yourself. Let's leave all the people. You're trying to be the old you so bad you don't stand yourself. Mm. That's that now that that that's hard. That was crazy. Yo, you know what? He got some he got some uh he got some boards out here that he landing in this one. I like, ain't going I ain't going even front. You know what I'm saying? Like, Cause I wanted to hear because everybody been saying like, yo, he got off, he got off. Did he? Yeah. This was the song right here, cause you know around this time, this is when nobody would dare come from Eminem. Um he was almost a rap god. But have you seen three hundred? Uh, the, the the movie with War the three hundred soldiers. Yeah, yes. yeah. All right, you remember? Um, he had the shield, and he all he wanted to do was at the end because he knew they had the uh they had the flank on him. He had to throw his spear at the god thing, but he knew how to get like three hundred yards in front of him. So he's like, at first I took off my helmet, and then I got on my knees. Then he got up and he threw it, and the spear came and whoo, and it was like blood came out, and you knew he could bleed. Yeah, this what this was. Yeah, you seen okay. Sh- it was a, this is like it was, it was a flesh wound. Yes, it definitely was. But he knew he could bleed. Everyone looked at Eminem like he does bleed. Yeah, facts. Still can't cover up the facts. Your last four albums as bad as your selfie. Now tell me, what are you staying for? What? I know you can't stand yourself. Bro. Trying to be the old you so bad you staying yourself. <laughs> Let's leave all the beef in the fifty. Please. Right. Em, you're pushing fifty. Why you claiming I'ma call Puff when you the one that called Diddy back? Then you went and called Jimmy back. The cops called me in the morning. They told me you mad about a tweet. You wanted me to say sorry. I swear to God I ain't believe him. Please say it ain't so. The big bad bully of the rap game can't take a fucking joke. You telling me to call Diddy? You called Demi? You you called Jimmy IV? Uh, talking so about you called everybody. You want me to apologize for a tweet? This was a tweet, bro. I wasn't even being serious. Just a tweet. You can't take a joke. Can't Eminem. Ever since we know you, you've been a comical guy. Yeah. The comical guy can't take a joke. And coming at everybody though. Facts. 
I don't know. I wasn't around there. I get around. The, I don't know nothing about the tweets and none of that. I'm just Dang, breaking hey, down what I'm, he's saying. I'm, 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 I'm a. It's an observation. Yeah, from what he's saying, we're just breaking. A down conversation. His, we're breaking down his bars. What he's saying. We don't know if it's Dang. true or not true. We ain't, we ain't fact check none of this. We ain't fact check none of the <laughs> facts. Puff, when you the one that called Diddy facts, then you went and called Jimmy facts. The cops called me in, in the, the morning. morning. They told me you mad about a tweet. You wanted me to say sorry. sorry. I swear to God, I ain't believe him. Please say Straight it ain't, ain't so. so. The big bad bully of the rap game can't take Make a fucking joke. Oh, you want some fucking smoke, but not literally you'll choke. Mm. Yeah, I'll acknowledge you the goat, but I'm the gunner, bitch. I got you in the scope. Don't have a. I acknowledge you the goat. You the goat. I'm the, I'm the gunner. gunner. I got, got you, you in my scope. scope. That was hard. The big bad bully of the rap game can't take a fucking joke. Oh, you want some fucking smoke, but not literally you'll choke. Yeah, I'll acknowledge you the goat, but I'm the gunner, bitch. I got you in the scope. Don't have a heart attack now. Somebody help your man. Now I understood the album art. That's crazy. <laughs> Listen, you know how Circle of Life, the song we just did, him dissing Ever Everlast. Mm -hmm. He was talking about how he was older. Right. Now you got a younger rapper talking about how you're older. You're going to have a heart attack. Same stuff he was saying about Everlast. He came back full circle. <laughs> That's yeah. what I'm hearing when but I hear this. What hit me too was when he said, now nah, I got you in the scope. I was like, yo, wasn't that the uh, kill shot for the kill guy shot. in the scope? Facts. So he came back throwing bars before he even said anything. But that was Eminem cover with the kill yeah, shot. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Facts. That's wild. Yeah. Make a fucking joke. Oh, you want some fucking smoke, but not literally you'll choke. Yeah, I'll acknowledge you the goat, but I'm the gunner, bitch. I got you in the scope. Don't have a heart attack now. Somebody help your man's up. Damn. Knees weak or old age. The real Slim Shady can't stand up. I'm sick of that. Was hard. The real Slim Shady can't stand up. Cause when he came out with a real Eminem, please stand up. Please stand up. He's saying now you're too old, you can't stand up. But it's basically going off what he was doing to Everlast when he did the Everlast. Yeah. This we just reacted to. Yeah. And I'm glad we just reacted to that because this is... It's wild how he um, like symbolically is eating a bowl of cereal. Like, I, I do this. I'll eat you up for breakfast. This type. is play. You know what I mean? This ain't nothing. And like now in this uh, 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 visual, he got a shovel. Like, I'm about to bury you. Yeah, that's what it's about. It's a funeral. You know what I'm saying? Like... It's hard. It's a funeral. And he shot this. I, in, he I, shot this in like, he was on, I remember when all this came out. He was on tour. Um, I think it's a tour bus or something out there. He just shot this real quick, got out the tour bus, shot a video real quick. And oh, it came so, out to be this. So like, he, at this time, he wanted to smoke for people who were saying, you, you want to smoke. Pretty much. Yeah, I'll acknowledge you the goat, but I'm the gunner, bitch, I got you in the scope. Don't have a heart attack now. Somebody help your mans up. Help. Knees weak or old age. The real Slim Shady can't, can't stand, stand up. up. I'm sick of them sweatsuits and corny hats. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. Over a single dad from the Midwest, we can talk about it. Or we can get gully, I'll size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Hello, Marshall. My name's Colson. You should go back to recovery. <laughs> I know your ego is hurting just knowing that all of your fans discovered me. Mm. You like, damn, he a younger me. Mm -hmm. Seven dresses better and I'm ugly. Always making fun of me. Stop all the thuggery, Marshall. You living in luxury. Hey, look what you've done to me. Drop an album just be that was That was just dope. He's saying, like, when you see me, which is Cap, um, when right. you see me, you see the younger uh, version of you. Um, it's a dope song, but that right there. That was Cap. It's Cap. <laughs> Just knowing that all of your fans discovered me Hi. You like, damn, he a younger me Except he dresses better and I'm ugly Always making fun of me Stop all the thuggery, Marshall, you living in luxury Facts. Look what you've done to me Drop an album just because of me Damn, you in love with me You got money, but I'm hungry I like it this, but you won't say them lyrics out in front of me Shout out to F That's what you want to say to like them like people that's above you Like, you got more money than me, I give you that But you don't got this hunger This hunger I got inside of me is not Listen. inside of you You feel what I'm saying? I'm coming more from down here You've been up there for a while you almost kind of forgot what it felt like to be here. You can't even relate to down here no more. You're so high up. But I'm still down here. Yeah. And I'm trying to get from down here to where you are. I keep climbing. So I'm hungry right now. So, I mean, I resonated. Always making fun of me. Stop all the thuggery, Marshall. You living in luxury. Hey, look what you've done to me. Drop an album just because of me. Damn, you in love with me. You got money, but I'm hungry. I like it this, but you won't say them lyrics out in front of me. Shout out to every rapper that's a fun to me. Know that I'll never do you like the fuckery. Still bitter after everyone loves you. He say, all the rappers I'm under me, yo, you don't got to worry about me doing to you what he's trying to do to me. You feel what I'm saying? Facts. This is what I got. Facts. I got. I'm cooler with the directors and I'm the people. I'm gonna try to pull you up. That's it. the the gate. What they call the gatekeepers? The gatekeepers. You cool with the gatekeepers? So you are gonna try to get people, stop people from coming through the gate? You don't gotta worry about that with me. Um, but he never became anything where anybody would have had to <laughs> worry about him. Right. But I get the analogy. Right. 
but you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like running out of bombs in a war and you just flying your plane smack into him kamikaze style. That's crazy. That's Eminem. That's yeah, well. yeah, but you know what I'm saying? He was just, he, he had to throw a shot. Yeah. I guess, you know what I'm saying? That's how he felt. Right. That's why that response is worthy. But, like, I see you now, and I can't appreciate what they've been saying. I keep right. saying it because it's real. Like he, I don't know how you missed this. You must have been on a rock to miss this. Man, I had a lot going on. It, life be life. Man. Life be life. Facts. But this is I'm just because of me. Damn, you in love with me. You got money, but I'm hungry. I like it this, but you won't say them lyrics out in front of me. Shout out to every rapper that's up under me. Know that I'll never do you like the fuckery. Still bitter after everyone loves you. Put out wedgie after dungery. Sure. You gotta respect the OGs. And right. I know most of them personally. Hey, right. you just a bully acting like a baby. So I gotta read you a nursery mm -hmm. I'm the ghost of the future And you just have to need a Scrooge I said I'm flex, anyone can get it I ain't know it would be you I'm sick of this Wow, he didn't with the Ebenezer Scrooge bars though? That was crazy That was dope He said I said anybody could get it I ain't know it would be you I'm the ghost of the future I'm the future she You the past Wow you know, Emily Scrooge was a grumpy guy yeah, the <laughs> With grumpy. all the money Yeah, it had everything and it had nothing Grumpy it's crazy. You just a bully acting like a baby, so I gotta read you a nursery. I'm the ghost of the future, and you just have to need a Scrooge. I said I'm flex, anyone can get it. I ain't know it would be you. I'm sick of them sweatsuits and corny ass. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. it. Well, we single dads from the Midwest. We can talk about it. Or we can get bully. I'll size up your body and put some white chalk around it. Hey. Ride a shoddy, cause I got a road as dope. It's a fast <laughs> road. He said, I'm riding shoddy because I got to roll up. You know what I'm saying? You can't drive and roll up. I think yeah, shotgun. Yeah. Yo, bro, you drive. I, I roll this up. Now, I want to say he's bro. This is like 15 minutes, man. It was something crazy. Like, Oh, yeah, really? Yeah. Talk about it. Oh, we can go inside of your body and put some white chalk around it. Ride a shoddy because I got a road as dope. It's a fast road. Because she the tour buses out there between them. He was on tour. So, yeah, man, get, right. shoot this. Never get that camera. Never hesitate to say it to your face. I'm an asshole. Oh, my God. Yeah. Fuck you. We know you get nervous, rabbit. I see mama spaghetti all over your sweater. I wish rabbit. you would lose yourself in the records that you made a decade ago. They were better. According to them, you were... He hit him with the 8 Mile you reference. You have to. You have to. You spaghetti all over your shirt. You have to. Rabbit. That was crazy. Yo, that's wild. Great reference. Yeah. So, wait. This is like... From what I've heard in the last video, mm -hmm. this all started because they was walking past each other? No, that's Everlast. This is MGK and I'm two different rappers. Okay, okay, okay. I was, well, I still, somebody put in the comments, why did he throw this punch? Because if this you. came first. He just told you. Now he tells about a tweet. He tweeted. He tweeted. Eminem wanted to say sorry. And then he tried to go oh, yeah, black yeah, ball. Yeah. And then wow, this came from this. a tweet. Yeah. That's what he said. I don't know. That's all. I'm an asshole. Oh my yes, God. Fuck you. We know you get fit. nervous, rabbit. I see mama spaghetti all over your sweater. I wish you would lose yourself in the records that you made a decade ago. They were better. According to them, you're a national treasure. To me, you're soft as a feather. The type of be scared to ask Rihanna for a number. Just hold her umbrella. Ella, Ella. I'm not afraid. Okay, I see. Oh. <laughs> wow. Because it's like hard to picture that. Like Eminem trying to talk to Nikki or Rihanna or... Beyonce, it's like kind of hard to picture that. You feel me? That you made a decade ago, they were better. According to them, you were a national treasure. To me, you were soft as a feather. The type to be scared to ask Rihanna for a number. Just hold her umbrella, Ella, Ella. <laughs> I'm not okay, I'm not I'm not still on the couch. Mm. You got an Oscar, damn. Can anyone else get some food in their mouth? Mm. They made a movie about you. You and everybody. He said, yo, you got an Oscar. Can anybody else eat? Yeah, can like, anybody else eat out here? Like, can you step up away from the table? Like, I just want a, 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 one of them tomatoes for no reason. Yeah, it's like, crazy. Like, real talk. Told her umbrella, Ella, Ella. I'm not afraid. Okay, Oscar the Grouch, chill on the couch. You got an Oscar, damn. Can anyone else get some food in their mouth for real? They made a movie about you. You and everybody's top ten. Facts. You're not getting better with time, it's fine. Eminem, put down the pen. Mm. I'm writing an apology. Mm. Mm. Mm, that's kind You're not getting better with time. Put down um, the pen. That was a shot. And to keep it all in perspective, around this time... A lot of people were starting to tune Slim Shady out. Just keeping it real. Just keeping it honest. I don't know if you remember around the time. You don't even know when it drops around the time, but it's, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, like the towards it, started, like, mm. You feel what I'm saying? We was more listening to Eminem probably first, second, third album. You feel what I'm saying? Okay. After that, people started to 
not his real core fans, but a lot of people started to like started transition to into more look, look for another frequency. More fifty cent, more Jay Z, okay. Lil Wayne. It started to be Okay, I see about, the time spent. Yeah, yeah, about it was around that time. Jay Z fifty. Uh ja Rule had a little time. Um just that it just started to you know when fifty had it. He had it. He had it for a minute. Too. Yeah. Sure, damn, can anyone else get some food in their mouth? For real, they made a movie about you. You and everybody's top ten. You're not getting better with time. It's fine, Eminem. Put down the pen or write an apology. Or with a simple fact, you had a dish to acknowledge me. I am the prodigy. How could I even look up to you? You ain't as tall as me. Five eight, I'm six four. I'm gonna look up to you. You ain't even as tall as me. That was a good flip. Wow. I'm gonna look up to you. Not even as tall as you. It's fine, I'm never put down the pen. Or write an apology. Or with a simple fact, you had a dish to acknowledge me. I am the prodigy. How could I even look up to you? You ain't as tall as me. Five, eight, nine, six, four. Seven punches hold your head still. Last time you saw eight mile was at home on a treadmill. You were named after a kid. Mm. So you don't go back to the hood no more. No, you ain't outside. That's Last time you seen eight mile, it's eight miles on a treadmill. Wow. That was crazy. Prodigy, how could I even look up to you? You ain't as tall as me. Five, eight, nine, six, four, seven punches, hold your head still. Last time you saw eight mile was at home on a treadmill. You were named after a candy. I was named after a gangster. And don't be a sucker and take my burst off of Yellow Wolf's album. Mm. Yo. And after a candy. I was named after Blicky. You was named after some M&Ms. And please, I know Yellow Wolf on your label, but please don't take my verse off for the song. Mm. You gotta ask now, I guess. Cause Can I eat too, please? <laughs> at first, he said, he said, I wasn't saying nothing. You were saying something. Right. Now you had to ask. You know what I mean? It's crazy. Could you not do that to me again? It hurt a little bit. Right, just a little bit. Hold your head still. Last time you saw Eight Mile was at home on a treadmill. You were named after a candy. I was named after a gangster. And don't be a sucker and take my burst off of Yellow Wolf's album. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to feed my daughter. You try to stop the money to support her. You don't want to always talk about the action. Text me to Addy. I'm pulling up scrap. And I'm by my fucking self. Yo, you try to take food out of my mouth, daughter. Uh, text your Addy. I'm pulling up. <laughs> <laughs> we can knuckle up right now. That's crazy. But then there go lies because 50 Cent, I mean, Eminem said, I never try to take food out of anyone's daughter's mouth. So somebody's not telling the truth. You feel what I'm saying? Damn. Sucker and take my burst off of Yellow Wolf's album. Thank you, thank you. I just want to feed my daughter. You try to stop the money to support her. You the one always talk about the action. Text me the Addy, I'm pulling up scrappy. And I'm by my fucking self, what's happening? ESD Captain Smith, me and shoot me, that's what he's. And I'm by myself, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Thank you. I just want to feed my daughter. You try to stop the money to support her. You the one always talk about the action. Text me to Addy. I'm pulling up scraps. And I'm by my fucking self. What's happening? ESD captain salute me and shoot me. That's what he's gonna have to do to me when he realizes that it ain't shit he can do to me. Salute me or shoot me. You got two choices. I want to get two options. It's up to you, but you want to see me and that's your two we're options. Gonna handle this. That was crazy. You the one always talk about the action. Text me to Addy. I'm pulling up scraps. And I'm by my fucking self. What's happening? ESD captain salute me and shoot me. That's what he's gonna have to do to me when he realizes that it ain't shit he can do to me. Everybody always hated me. This isn't anything new to me. Yeah, there's a difference between us. I got all of my shit without Drake producing me. I know he's not used to me. I got all mines without Drake. Drake did everything. Mm. I mean, Eminem would have been a legend with any producer. We got to say, yeah, we're gonna give him that. Dre helped out, but, but M it is definitely still helped. M. Yeah, it helped, yeah, but, but M would have been M. Yeah, regardless. Yeah. When he realizes that it ain't shit he can do to me Everybody always hated me This isn't anything new to me Yeah, there's a difference between us I got all of my shit without Drake producing me I know you're not used to me Usually one of your disses should ruin me But bitch, I'm a Cleveland Everybody quiet this evening I'm reading the eulogy Dropped an album called Kamikaze He said, yo Normally, a song from you will end someone's career I'm actually reading uh, your eulogy. Um, to keep everything fair in perspective, um, they did say in the comment section, after this little beef between him and Eminem, he switched over to rock and roll and was no longer a rapper after this. So let's keep everything in fair perspective. Yes, this was a great it this song. It was a song, great this song. But after this, because he dropped the album around this time too, and it went double wood. I remember all this. His oh, album, so, so he hit the pivot. He, this right here was, you know, I got an album coming out. Let me... Let me throw some here so get my bu name bubbling. I'm on tour. Yeah. But it went double wood, and I, I don't mm -hmm. think he never had a rap. I mean, that's what they said. I don't know. But they say it's so that means to kill him. Already fucked one rapper, that's girl, this rude. week. Don't make me call Kim. <laughs> I'm sick of them sweatsuits. I'm corny. I already called one rapper's girl this week. <laughs> don't don't make me call Kim. 
I be quiet for seed and I'm reading the eulogy Dropped an album called Kamikaze So that means to kill him Already fucked one rapper girl this week Don't make me call kill <laughs> Yo, and then the fact that he ate cereal at the same, that's why I said, when he was eating the cereal, it looked so cool. <laughs> it looked something so simple, but it looked this. But so, it was cold. Yeah. Like, and, did you see when he said he's. Yeah, like it's nothing. And by the way, put in the comments, who girl he smashed? They don't know. They know. They that know everything. A, nah, man, that was just a bar. <laughs> Already fucked one rapper girl this week. Don't make me call Watch Kim. This. I'm sick of this. <laughs> Let's talk about it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's, Let's talk, talk about, about it. All of us sing that in the Midwest. We can talk about it. Or we can get gully your size up your body and put some white chalk around it. <laughs> it's Trey TV. Let's get it. This is Mar Wilson here representing Ghetto Action News Network underscore all lower cases. No spaces. And you can find us on Facebook. And when you do, make sure you hit the like button. I'm going to get right into this one. This video by MGK Rap Devil. I see why they were saying you should check it out. Yeah, just one of the ones. Just one of the ones. And it's tough. You know <laughs> yeah. what I'm saying? I'm actually seeing it in the reverse order. I saw uh, Shady's response. But I, I, I wonder, why did he respond anyway? I see why. You had to. I see why he had to. You had to. MGK really came smack at his neck. Mm -hmm. or, but in, in, a, in a fashion like it was nothing, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That cereal bowl joint, I see what you're saying. That was real disrespectful. But with the... You know, man, every once in a while, you be like, man... I'm tired of you older niggas. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It'd be like, it'd be like, sort of like what happened yesterday. Like, the, I'm not saying that's the case. You know, sometimes bigger entities want to try to push down on you. Like when we dropped that video, I ain't going to say what video it was. Right, and right, then right, a right. bigger channel dropped the same exact video to try to put out our fire. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody likes when people trying to put out your fire. Nobody like getting stepped on. But my fault, keep going. Nah, you good. <laughs> but like, you know what I'm saying? Just seeing the whole exactly good yeah. transition to where he felt like hey man i'm trying to get my shine you've been you've been eating he said it right. you've been eating make space you know what i'm saying but um <laughs> i see space. why they say that this was actually dope i think it was you know what i'm saying and i could see uh the shock value because at that time um as being explained the time span how nobody was really coming at him at all nah, and then scared. just seeing this come out of nowhere like that I, I, now I see why everybody was like, oh, you missed this, you missed this. It was yeah, dope, though. This was one of the ones. Um, if I had to rate this, I, it's, I, it seems crazy to me because I can't really go off the uh, value of catching it when it happened. But just like, I guess I have to go off a scale of uh, looking at rap battles on this one. Um, I'd probably get this like an eight. You know what I'm saying? But it's dope. I'd probably give him an extra point five just because of who he came at. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to give him an 8.5. What you think? Um, I think it was a tough diss song. I would put this in top 10 diss songs ever. The beat was cold. The visuals was cold. The raps were cold. I'm just putting in the time from when it came out. I heard it hours after it came out. I know the impact it had when it dropped. This was almost a Nas Ether when that dropped. And it was like, you have to respond to this because everyone was just liking it. All Every black, white, Mexican, everybody thought this was a cold diss song, so you had to respond. Um, and I thought he did a good job uh, with the response. And, mm -hmm. and I remember Eminem responding within 24 or 48 hours. Oh, so and it was quick, quick. That's what made it so legendary because time has dropped, Eminem dropped like probably the next day, if I'm remembering correctly. It was something like that, it was a big impact. <sighs> On World Star too. That's when World Star was popping. Everybody was on World Star. Um, so it was like one of those. But this is like one of them type of songs that every almost every great artist takes one like this. Like Jay Z caught one from Nas. Um, who else caught one? Um, Jay Z caught one from Nas. Fifty Cent caught one. I mean, Jairo caught one from Fifty Cent. Oh, uh, who would LL get? Uh, uh, cannabis. cannabis. Like all good rappers, you catch one. Drake got caught by Pusha T with the Adonis song. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? It happened to all the greats. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> they get caught with one rapper by one song because they're not talented. It's a bunch of talented rappers in the world that you could get right. caught with a straight shot, and that's kind of what happened. This he got caught with a straight shot. Like I said, it was a little face graze, uh, nothing major. A little, mm -hmm. little one or two drops of blood came out. But right. Eminem was still Eminem. He's still doing numbers today. He's still great today. But as far as this records, um, I thought this was a dope one. Um, if I had to rate this on a scale of one to ten, what did you give it? I think I gave it eight point five. Eight point five. I gave it a nine point five, and I can't wait until we get into our next reaction. It's your boy Trey TV, and I'm out.